Hi everyone, Alan here once again. Don't know how long this will take, this uh, video. Um, yeah. Well, season's greetings to you all. I've been having a look at some of the videos that have been going up. Uh, bad news. Well, depends on your, uh, on your view. Um... The the government is expecting uh, twenty thousand Afghan refugees to turn up very soon. Where we're going to put them, I don't know, because everybody knows in this country we have something called a housing crisis. Are these people going to get uh, pres? Presidents of uh, the people who are already waiting, and plus we've been hearing that um, quite a lot of hotels near the airports are full, so that only leaves that only leaves a number of places. They're talking about acquiring some hotels in Blackpool well we know how that went down didn't we don't we um, that the Metropole uh, housed a number of Afghan refugees well as I said there's going to be 20,000 turning up where are we going to put them uh, the other thing is, we have a major housing crisis of our own, as people are being, uh, well, they're using no fault evictions, and I've been seeing these things coming up on on Facebook and places like that. You know, we have a housing crisis in this country. You know. What, where are we going to put these people? And you've got uh, places like um, places that uh, are turning around and saying we're not going to allow high rise. Well, I'm sorry, f sorry, those places that uh, are turning around and saying not uh, uh, allowing um, high rise. Where are you going to put all these people? Where are you going to put... If these people get UK citizenship, 20,000, where are you going to put these 20,000 people? You know, they can't stay in hotels forever. You know. And there are quite a lot of people on the waiting list already for council houses, etc. You know... Councils are going to have to uh, turn round and approve these tower blocks because, to be truthful, you know, where are these people going to go? You know? And I know Manchester's building another, allowing another four. Uh, tower blocks go up by it, you know, the, the um, Deansgate Square area. I know they're allowing four more to go up. Uh, they've rejected one tower um, because of the amount of building building that's going on there for, I think it was a 60 storey building for stu student accommodation but uh, you know well, it's a wait and see situation but we can't keep putting it off uh, we're going to have to put these people somewhere and you know putting them in hotels is going to be another burden on the taxpayer 
Where, where does this money come from? You know, it's absolutely horrendous. Um, yeah, this is the only way that the you're going to basically uh, get these people homes. And uh, I've been saying to some of my friends, well, if you are thinking of getting a place, you know, and you're in the Manchester area, uh, just don't buy, just don't get it for one person, two person, three person. Get a group of friends, you know, and if you all get on together, well, all well and good. And get a get an apartment, a three bedroom apartment, and share it among and share the rent between yourselves. Just as long as you don't fall out with each other, you'll be fine. Um. Yeah. Like. Like, you know, it's pretty, pretty tidy where that, uh, where that, all that's going up. It's not like here, Blackburn. You know, they're struggling to get people houses here because they haven't put enough up. And I think really Blackburn with Darwin Council are going to have, you know, they're going to have to Rethink their re rethink their ideas, because two and three bedroom terrace houses are not going to be, not going to cut it, you know, because there aren't that many. And they've been building some new homes at Bank Top, you know, next to a, shall we say, rough area, Gallagher's Estate. You know, you go walk round Gallagher's. There's more, more. There's more. There's more than more houses with bricked up, with uh, boarded up windows and everything. It looks an absolute mess. You know, it's always been a bad area as uh, as that area, Gallagher's. So you know, Blackburn, clean your act up. Because, you know, you don't really deserve city status. I'd rather, if Blackpool was in the running, I'd rather give it to Blackpool than give it to you. You know, if the queen, if the you know, if the queen, if the queen had the proper walk round, round the, uh, round the town. You know, it's says taking the cathedral area where it's all nicey nicey. You know, it it needs a lot of Blackburn needs pulling down and redoing. And I I don't really care what people say. You know, all black tower blocks, you no know, horrible things. Well, not if they're done right. Not if they're done right. Well, I'm gonna bugger off in a minute because I'm gonna go see what Walk on the Wild Side's doing. Uh, on one of his videos so that's all for now so it's three two one click